Angry Birds the Movie in 3D, a 2016 release. A one hour and 37 minute movie, 6.2 on International Movie Database right now, 43% Rotten Tomatoes uh, critics, 46% audience approval on Rotten Tomatoes, 1.85 to 1 aspect ratio, so you will get the big beautiful screen. Uh, this is Dolby Digital Master, True HD, excuse me, English Dolby True HD 7.1 sound. This is directed by Clay Cadis and Fergal Riley. Uh, you know, look, I'm going to mispronounce names. You know that. Uh, this stars Jason Sudeikis as Red. Uh, you got Josh Gad as Chuck. You got Danny McBride as Bomb, and you have uh, Maya Rudolph as Matilda. Uh, and you have Sean Penn as Terrence. Sean Penn, I did say that. And Blake Shelton as Earl Pig. Imagine that, Blake Shelton and Sean Penn have voiceovers in here. So what am I doing with this movie? Well, one of my three amigos, I, uh, that Go Find Fun channel, over at the Go Find Fun channel, it's a 3D movie review channel, uh, he, we collaborate and uh, he recommended this and go check out his review. I'll put a link in here to it. Uh, one of my other, my other two amigos are uh, 3D Blu-ray Bunker. Go check out his channel. He's got a lot of good reviews. He has not reviewed this one. And LJ Draco. He's my other amigo. Those are my three amigos. Go find fun. LJ Draco and 3D Blu-ray Bunker. Check out their, their reviews. It's awesome. Well, anyway, so he turned me on this movie. I said, I got to get it. I got to get it. Look, this is a movie... <laughs> Look, you're thinking it's a movie about the game that came out on the phone. Well, it is. It is. But listen, this is a gas. What a gas this is. It's hilarious. It is so funny. I got to tell you something. The music score is incredible. You got rock tracks. You're going to recognize some rock tracks from way back. Disco track. Uh, the music's really, really great. Turn it up. It's pumping. So what's happening here? You got Red, the the, the angry bird. Red. He's got. He's got this. There he is. He's got this anger management issue, and uh, he's. Look, there's a scene in here in the beginning. There's gonna be some spoilers here, but he he. There's a scene here in the beginning. It reminds me of. Uh, uh, when that clown showed up at Uncle Buck's house, because uh, he, he he plays a clown in here and he's bringing he's he's bringing a cake. He's late. He's running through the jungle. Uh, he has anger management issues. So this is an island of birds. Angry Birds is an island of birds. No, nobody flies. Nobody flies except for one bird, uh, an eagle that nobody's seen in many years. Uh, and so he has to go to this anger management class. And the lady running the anger man management class, absolutely hilarious. Uh, and then you got Bob in here, and you've got uh, uh, Chuck, Speedy Chuck, on the cover here. You got so you got Speedy Chuck, you got Red, and you got Bob in here. They're all in the anger management class. And what you know what happens is is these pigs show up to this island, and Red says something's off here, guys. Something's off, and nobody believes them, and uh, things don't go so good. And they try to call in the great eagle, uh, the only bird that's ever flown and nobody's seen him in years, to help him because the pigs are wreaking havoc. And uh, I'm not going to spoil the movie too much for you. Um, the, the pigs wreak a lot of havoc and then uh, the angry birds have to uh, make a decision and have to... I'm not going to tell you. You got to watch it. You just got to watch it. It's absolutely incredible. Let's talk about the 3D now. The 3D is, the 3D is fantastic. It's fantastic. The depths are there. The colors are there. You're going to get pop outs. You're going to get stick outs. You're going to get beaks sticking out. You're going to get things flying out. You're going to get fly outs, pop outs, stick outs. You're going to get a lot of depth. You got that one, that big 1.85 to 1 screen, which makes it really, really nice. Um, however, there is some rendering in the background, some rendering that kind of makes it look, uh, you know, like an artboard or storyboard in the background. I thought when they were climbing up on the mountain, um, they could add a little bit more detail in there. But the up close 3D and things immediately behind and in the village and things like that, it's the faraway scenes to me that look a little um, rendered. So, you know, of course it's all rendered. but. Um, I did notice uh, there's at the Pig City, I think at the Pig's Castle, I, I disagree with somebody. They said it looked a little bit video game-ish, but I have to say this. 
I have the depths looking through that castle, the depths. Go back and watch it. Look down those hallways and look at those depths into that castle. And to me, it's the deepest 3D scene in the movie. Uh, let's talk about the humor a little bit. Now, the humor, the humor hits, man. It's funny as heck throughout this movie. And there's a lot of adult innuendos in here. I mean, you got to look. You maybe it's in my mind, but I'm picking up on a lot of adult innuendos in here. Um, clean for the kids, but you can watch it with your kids and you pick up on those adult innuendos and some crude humor, some really crude humor, but nothing really, nothing really gross. So what I'm going to do with this, Angry Birds, the movie in 3D, I'm going to give it for an animated flick, I'm going to give it uh, four and a half stars and for the 3D, I'm going to give it four and a half stars. All right. So that's my take on it. So what did you think? Did you see it? Did you see it in 3D? Did you see it in 2D? Did you see it at the theaters in 2016 in 3D? I got to tell you, I got to have the grandkids over here. We've got to watch this. Of course, they're getting older now because that was uh, six years ago and they're all older now. So uh, I don't know if, they're, if they'd be interested, but I'll tell you, it's, it's a great film. Leave some comments below. Hit that like and subscribe button. I got a lot more reviews coming out. I want you to stay safe. I want you to have a great night. And as always, God bless.